Hi there, my name is Anna Siegfried. I'm the skincare director here at Oriflame, and today I have Dr. Alain Mavon with me. Hello, guys, pleasure. Um, and we're going to answer some of your questions on skincare. So, Alain, the first question What is the proper age of when it's good to start paying attention to your skin? Yes, that's a good question, yeah. as you know, it's never too early to start taking care of your skin you know if you even if you are kids you need to protect again UV and, uh, and the sun damages that's mm -hmm. very important as you get a bit older you should target your skin your acne problems and af as you are turning 20 differently that's where you start to have your own skincare routine that answer your skin needs and from there you obviously has to have to adjust with the environment you are living in so when does your skin start getting older and how can we slow down this process? So the skin starts to, not yet to get older, but could be impacted by damages uh, uh, around 20. Mm -hmm. And that's where you need and you recommend to start having your daily skincare routine that fits your own skin needs mm -hmm. to achieve and maintain a healthy skin and really start already at this age to slow the aging process there. And that's where the Novage four-step routine has been designed to help your skin you slow down this aging process with the different steps you know as you know by heart and it's also really beside the four steps also with the, the four steps is really crucial to protect your skin from the UV and the pollution damage is there so that's where you really start to slow down this aging process okay but uh, what else besides a good skincare routine can we do to to make our skins looks look good Long term. Yes, absolutely. You know, the, the skin is part of our body. So mm. definitely having a healthy uh, routine will help both your, for your body, but also for your skin, which means it's include having a regular exercise. You bring more oxygen to your skin. That's important. And also a healthy diet where you bring to your diet more vitamins and antioxidants. That's really, really important, again, for the body, but also for the skin. And of course, a good sleep, you know, this beauty sleep, it's not really, it's not a myth, it's that's where your skin repair as you sleep. So very, very important to have the right length of sleep. Very important, very good tips there. Uh, can you then tell me this? What is the best recipe to have radiant skin? So radiant skin, yes, again, uh, sleep will be, if you uh -huh. sleep better and you can see that if you don't sleep enough, your, your skin look dull. Uh, again, on the top of your routine, what we, we are recommending is to, you have, uh, to add a skin peeling, mm. which helps to remove these dead skin cells, making then your skin much more luminous and then radiant, obviously. Mm -hmm. um, we got an interesting question here as well. Uh, it's about the ingredients. So someone is asking us, why are silicones so often used in cosmetics? Silicones are very interesting. Uh, materials, raw materials, because they are really give a very specific touch and feel of the cream and the mm. formulation. They make them much more lighter, much nicer to apply and definitely bring a very strong sensory feeling. So that's why they are so often used. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now on to the future. So uh, from your perspective, Alain, what is the most advanced skincare trend right now? Um, definitely, we mentioned it already, mm -hmm. but this is this holistic beauty, you know, taking care of your skin, the skincare approach is not just only with the skin product. Obviously, you need this daily skincare routine and especially the four step Novage routine. But beside that is really having a more holistic approach on beauty. As we mentioned, having this healthy lifestyle, feeding your, your body with the right nutrition and definitely exercising, sleeping. So having a more holistic approach on how you take care of your skin. That's where the trend is moving. Mm -hmm. So thank you Dr. Alain Mavon for answering these questions on skincare.